Hey guys, this is Jaslyn and welcome back for more the Witcher 3 Wow Hand. Right, so let's go and meet up with Philippa in the Elven Runes to search for the Sunstone. So from the previous episode, we tried to make Siri happy and I guess we have already success in making her happy. Right now we are going to focus on our new objective. Okay, and our runes. Where is that place? Right, it's here. I think we can go for a swim. I'm not too sure. Because I guess this is the mountain. Yep, let's go for a swim then. Or let's Foreigner, take the boat. Just in case my video capture card these days is giving me an issue. Later. Okay, thank goodness those things are not following me. mention of that deviant is purely coincidental. Mm -hmm. Of course. Also heard of this rich blind dwarf from Mahakam. Had them put two sizable rubies in his eye sockets. Couldn't see a damn thing. But word is, it looked pretty tasteful. <laughs> oh my good freaking goodness. Garrett is so funny. He has a good sense of humor. <laughs> to follow her. Witcher. Hear that? Hmm. Just saying. 
flopless. Stairs, I'll fix them right away. Ooh, something like repair or <laughs> repair or from Hogwarts Legacy. I need to start playing back that game as well. Ready, let's go. Thank Couldn't you. help notice the tension between you and Yennefer and Trace. It's very hard on Siri, I think. There are times I doubt you three realize how it looks. Tris plays the big sister to Siri, but eagerly awaits a chance to hop in bed with you. <laughs> you and Yennefer play the parents. Yeah, so if you're angling to make it a five sum, there's clearly no room. <laughs> five sum. <laughs> oh, but that's very funny and kind of weird too. <laughs> Gala, I'm just stood there and to see Tris calling Siri as sis but Geralt is actually dating with Tris it's like dating own daughter's friend <laughs> yeah this is kind of weird <laughs> well Philippa is kind of right <laughs> I do get that meaning It appears I must do everything for you. See the sentry who seems to be waiting for payment. I'm fresh out of change. Oh, in blood, not coin. The sentry is Fiona, the elven legend. Do you literally read nothing? Ouch. Not easy to become a sorceress. Have to hurt. Have to get hurt. <laughs> there you are. Hmm. Yennefer must have tremendous pull with the Emperor to get him to guarantee the lodge's safety. What's your take on it? My take. 
obviously a leading question. No. Geralt, I'm tired. Let's sit and chat a bit first. Is foreplay that important to you? <laughs> Hash it out with Jennifer. You ought to talk to Jennifer. Painfully clear there's unfinished business there. Yennefer's always walked her own path. I'm actually touched she decided to take an interest in the matters of the Lodge this time. You don't trust her. So once the hunt's defeated, leave. Find asylum elsewhere. I hear a Dania's offering. I'd sooner stick my head in a Zoogle's spiky orifice. Thanks, but I've other plans. No, I said that to vote with the Emperor. You'll get to work with the Emperor. Not excited? No. I, I mean, yes, of course I am. Thus far, the Lodge has oft banked on weak rulers. It's been one of our biggest mistakes. <laughs> so you're impressed Emir keeps his mages on a short leash? Yennefer's wise to keep you out of politics. I'm afraid you'd not realize which way the wind was blowing if you pissed straight into it. Deal with Emir is sorceress business. This deal with Emir. It's sorceress business. Pick someone else's brain. So she's not told you anything? What about personal plans? Has she mentioned anything? A possible advisory position? Beside a young, promising empress? Stay away from Ciri. She's an adult, Geralt. You keep forgetting. She can decide for herself. So, onward. Yes. Don't you think it's time you stopped interfering in Ciri's life? No. But you do know we're not a pack of wolves you can just drive away from her with your sword. Sure you are. And yes, I can, if the need arises. Wait. There's something here. Feel it? What's no. that? My medallion. A ridiculous bauble. <laughs> Tuning into elven magic is just slightly more difficult than sniffing out a malodorous fiend. Watch this. Luma! That means the sunstone is here. Don't stand there looking stupid. Try to shift the mirrors. Ooh. Okay. Set up the mirror system properly. Gary <laughs> oh. is so funny. That Dele doesn't sense anything. I guess he wanted to say this.
We have a matter to discuss. Let me guess. You gotta fly. You're about to tell me why you need the Sunstone so much more than we do. Then you'll change into an owl and whoosh. <laughs> no idea where you got such a ridiculous notion. <laughs> Ciri's safety is most important to me now. But I wish to talk to you about the future. My future. Uh, I recommend uh, I'll buy Air of Nazi. You're like Nilfgaard, no two ways about it. I recommend the fresh alpine air of Nazaire. <laughs> and Yennefer claims you have no sense of humor. Now listen carefully. Once we've defeated the hunt and Ciri is safe, Yennefer's meteoric rise at the Imperial Court will come to an abrupt end, which is wonderful from my perspective. I'm not interested in reviving the Lodge if I'm not to have the deciding vote. You're telling me this because... If I know even one bit, I expect that once we've defeated the Wild Hunt, you aim to slip out the back door with Ciri. To disappear into the wilds, correct? All very romantic. But perhaps instead of destroying the girl's life, you could take Yennefer with you and go. Triss might object. Ah, yes. So give Yennefer some friendly advice, would you? She'll listen to you. You want to take Yen's place beside Amir. You want to take Yen's place at Amir's side. And at Ciri's. I think you understand it's inevitable. And I would truly prefer Yennefer to be far away when it happens. Holding her in the Imperial Dungeon would be costly. And it would give the wrong impression. Done. Can we go? Any other words of wisdom? Or can we go? You may go. I know you have things to do. <laughs> and she just left me here. Oh man. Let Avalok know everything's ready. But Avalok seems hiding something. It's not seems it's indeed hiding something. Why should I need to let him know? Go to here. Wait, any fast travel point here so that we don't have to hide. guys I'll just leave this place and I'll see you in a minute wait something to grab here sweet cat witch slayer Moments later. Come on. Oh my freaking goodness. my weapon and I don't know what is wrong with the interface see glitch
coming to this place. Oh, I hate feeling that so much. No wonder Dijkstra hates her. <laughs> <laughs> Finally I'm out of here. Oh my gosh, I hate this place so much. Oof, it's like a maze, man. Okay. Hunter. And the weir bears attacked Claire Trolder. Later. Let's go Whoa. and see. I, I never doubted you would. But why did you? You might have just asked. To hear you reveal all about your experiments with the Elder Blood Gene? Unlikely. I've hidden nothing that could be useful in our struggle against Eredin. As regards the Elder Blood, you're all aware Ciri is exceptional. I am alone only in knowing to what extent. Or maybe you're just obsessed with her. I'm obsessed. Basically. Yes, Geralt? Went by your laboratory. Went by your laboratory. I trust you did not make a mess. <laughs> didn't mention you were the NL Elves' chief source we of knowledge about Ciri's abilities. I didn't mention many things. Fortunately, they're no longer important. Your experiments with the gene, Elder Blood, that's not important. I pursued those studies to protect Ciri. To protect Lara Doran's blood in whomever's veins it courses. Maybe this is all about Lara for you. So maybe you're hoping to gain control of Lara herself after all these years? Lara is dead. My only hope is that Ciri will fulfill her calling and survive. Okay, how's Margarita? Margarita any better? I managed to accelerate tissue regeneration. She's feeling much better. In fact, we must bring Eridin here as soon as possible. Otherwise, I'm afraid these sorceresses of yours will start fighting amongst themselves. Okay. Um. Why are you helping Siri? You imprisoned yes. Siri the first time you met her. Now you protect her while fighting against your own kind. Quite an about face. <laughs> first of all, I did not imprison her. She found me. It was her destiny. Yeah, sure. Get to the second of all. Why are you helping her? Because she is a danger. A mortal one. You look at her and see a human. A ward. A daughter, even. I look and see the Elder Blood. A power that can destroy the world. A power that must be kept from Eredin's power-addled hands at all costs. Admittedly, our motives differ. Yet in spite of that, we share a goal. So, you would be wise to trust me. Or at least try. Okay. Soon Siri won't need your help anymore. From the look of things, pretty soon Siri won't need your help anymore. Nor yours. True. She'll do whatever she wants, and I'll support her. What about you? Ready to let her live her own life? I shan't force her to do anything if that's your question. Okay. Uh, 
say we use the sandstone mod then? Once we use the sunstone, what makes you think Aridin won't figure things out? I doubt he'll think the elves of the White Fleet suddenly long to see him. We can alter the signal emitted by the sunstone. Unlikely Aridin will recognize its origin. It's not the only artifact to possess this power. There are others? Great. Now mind telling me why I had to scour Skellige looking for this one? The sunstone was the easiest to find, believe me. Charming, this world of the NL. Charming world you NL have got. Could easily fall in love with the place. Tell me, how do you do it? Sit around playing flute, painting rutting unicorns and gorgeous landscapes, building ornately sculpted towers? And then you murder us, without batting an eye, without a hint of guilt. How? Do you humans feel guilt when you murder Enshe elves? Or dwarves? Or dryads? We are the same. Simply because we both firmly believe others are inferior. Okay. Tell me about him. Tell me something more about Karanthir. Know him well? Know him? I reared him. Raised, don't you mean? No, Geralt. I began shaping him long before he was born. For centuries, I brought together pairs of elves manifesting certain abilities. Those able to manipulate time and space. He is the result of these efforts. Caranthia, a golden child. Golden child who grew up to be a criminal. Everything's ready, we can go to Undi. We found the sunstone. Gelban's gift to Dillion of the White Flea. As legend has it, she never used the stone and Gelban died of sorrow. Won't keep Aridin waiting that long. It seems we've everything. We can go. Keep in mind, once we commit, There'll be no returning. <sighs> Taking care of everything. Ready when you are. I'm ready. High time we set sail. Undvik awaits. In that case, let's go. I can't wait. I just really want to proceed. You will position yourselves on the cliffs. Here, here, and... Thank you. I believe we know how to form a circle. Even those of us who lack eyes for the moment. I simply wish to avoid... Oh, Geralt. We were waiting for you. Uh, how nice. That's nice of you. You were about to explain your plan? It's simple. Which does not mean it will be easy to execute. I shall activate the Sunstone. If Caranthia answers the call, the Nagel Fair should appear in the bay shortly afterwards. The Lodge must then prevent the ship from returning to the world of the NL, while the Imperial Fleet blocks its escape by sea. The 7th Imlet's Infantry Regiment under Duke Varatra must then board it. With your help, naturally. What about you? Where will you be? Waiting in reserve. If something goes wrong, I shall react. Mm -hmm. Like a general commanding troops from a hilltop? <laughs> gonna signal us by horn or use messengers? <laughs> Exquisite irony, but what did I do to deserve it? Mm. Have I given you cause to doubt my intentions? Ladies and gentlemen, less talk, more action, please. Sisters, we must scale the cliffs. Good luck. missing one important element. What about Ciri? Cyril will wait, at a safe distance from the Nagel Fair. Yes, this. Wild guess. Not what you had in mind. No. I wanted to go with you. That was my idea. But I won't allow it. Far too great a risk. Got no right to give her orders. Don't have the right to order her around. Amusing. Zirel said the same thing, only at much higher volume. <laughs> I do, in fact, have this right. 
For only I know how to activate the Sunstone, which I shall do on my terms or not at all. Tyrell recognized the strength of my argument. I have no doubt you will do the same. Tyrell, do you swear to stay on shore? Do I have a choice? Where are you going? For a walk. Or is that not allowed either? Because I could break my leg. <laughs> Stop controlling me. Oh yes. I hate people control. The elder me. blood can be fine. <laughs> okay. Got her personality from her father. Forbidding Siri from doing things is pointless. Yes. Telling Siri she can't do something is counterproductive. Speaking from experience there. Ultimately, she does what she wants. Let us hope. Pardon me? Never mind. Time is short. If you wish to do something, brew your substances or whatnot, do it now. You won't get the chance later. I shall await you by the boats amongst the soldiers. I just wanted a moment to talk to you before before it begins. Chin up. The hunt's weakened. We've got No, no more about the battle. Just hold me and say something nice. Oh, a sweet time. <laughs> uh, can't wait till there's a lighthouse from the far of you. <laughs> Let's say this. Hmm. There's a lighthouse not far from here, you know. Geralt, are you suggesting we... No. Well, at least not right now. <laughs> Just wanted to say... Wanted to say that since... Since Novigrad, whenever I see the beam of a lighthouse, I feel good. Thinking of you. <laughs> Unbelievable. You said something romantic. Oh. You, Geralt of Rivia. Moment of weakness. Why, <laughs> none of those during the battle, please. If anything should happen to you. be fine. I'll manage. You always say that. I haven't killed me yet. <laughs> well, except for that one time. Ah, uh, Geralt, you're so charming when you try to be funny. Try? Take it back. That was a great joke. <laughs> sure. I love you, you know. You trying to make me cry? Siri never let me forget it. Go on, get. <laughs> So nice. <laughs> Love you too. Why don't you say that in front of her? <laughs> ah, okay. Right. Talk to Evelyn when you are ready to fight. Let's see where am I now. Still have some side quests to do and uh, my witcher's witcher contracts quest. Yeah. Okay guys, I guess I'll be staying here right now. Um because I guess I really need to get ready first before we are going to start this on the thin ice bed quest. Yeah, so it is so nice to see Tris and Geralt uh, having a romantic moment. I hope you'll get to see that on the other episode as well. <laughs> yeah. Especially right after we have defeated the Wild Heart. Okay, guys, so if you guys enjoyed for today's video, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And I hope to see you next time. Bye!